Hello everyone, this is Kriti Shah from Derivative Risk Access Security. I'm presenting you Midman that derivative report. In this report, we are analyzing various derivative parameters like volatility index, OI, PCR, volatility is Q2, uh, predict further market movement. In the uh, second half of the December, we have witnessed significant pullback in the Nifty. However, Nifty has faced uh, stiff resistance around 7950 to 8000 level. The first half of the January series witnessed heavy selling pressure and Nifty lost almost 8% till date. However, here onwards we are expecting market to find support at the level of 7250 to 7300 region. Uh, moving to the volatility, volatility index is quoting around 21 level. The volatility index basically represents market expectation of near term volatility and uh, the mean reversal nature of the VIX suggests it to settle around 15 to 16 uh, level. This suggests short term pullback in the market, but however, the market may find resistance at the higher level. The put call ratio is quoting around 0.75 level, and basically, PCR is a contrarian indicator. The lower level of PCR again suggests the trend reversal pattern. Moving to the volatility skew, volatility skew basically represents, represents option implied volatility plotted against the respective strike price which is my affected by the market sentiments and supply and demand relationship. The left skewed volatility chart suggests the more bias towards the put option and hence we are expecting market to find support at lower levels. The nifty OI distribution data again suggests the maximum put concentration is still at 7300 and the, that can act as a good support followed by the level of 7200 whereas the maximum cost of concentration is at 7700 strike and that, that can act as a good resistance for the current expiry. Based on the data, we are suggesting uh, two strategies. One is on the SPI. The strategy that, suggest, uh, that we are suggesting is, is uh, on the SPI is bull call spread. In this strategy, we are buying 185 call strike and we are selling 195 call strike. The call at a strike of 185 is quoting at 5.45 rupees, whereas the 195 call is quoting at 2.45. So net net we have to pay the premium that is to the tune of rupees 3 that comes around 6000. The 6000 is the maximum loss in the strategy. On a higher side uh, the 195 can be the maximum uh, profit potential and that can be up to rupees 14000. The uh, maximum loss in the strategy is fixed at 6000 whereas the maximum profit is fixed at 14000 level rupees. Uh, the second strategy that we are suggesting is Nifty Bull Call Ratio Spread. In this strategy, we are buying 7400 call strike and we are selling two 7550 call strikes. The 7400 call strike is quoting around premium of 86 rupees, whereas 7550 strike is quoting around premium of rupees 30. So, net net, we have premium outflow that is around rupees 2000 and that can be the maximum loss in the strategy below 7400. The maximum profit potential is at an around 7550, that is around rupees 9000. However, the uh, above 7675 level, uh, the uh, second call that we have right will start generating loss and we need to buy one lot of future to hedge the entire strategy.